This is the wall resisted isometric targeting your calf and soleus all around a sprinter position, just applying force. Why are we doing this? For tendon health, tendon resiliency, better isometric strength that'll translate to more force and more strength overall. So let's just get into that runner position where you're pressing the wall. Try and literally move the wall. Obviously that won't happen, but we want that effort to be that maximal, that maximally contracted, just pressing in that figure four position. You could have a straight torso or kind of be in some extension like I am, just trying to move the wall as best as I can. So just showing you some more views and let's see this now in an application of a professional sport where you're changing direction, you're sprinting. Now you're gonna see one of the best tennis players in the world, Rafael Nadal, and his sudden need to change direction Watch his left foot as he is reacting to a ball. He suddenly has to plant that foot, boom, right there, pressing the ground away into a dead sprint. This is where you're going to see it. This is where you're going to use it.